Hi, some shines. Welcome back to our channel, Mac Curls. I'm Taylor Ann. And I'm Lorraine. Welcome to the Mac Curls Wash and Go and Tutorial. Mm -hmm. This time we are bringing to you a brand. We are bringing to them. What are we bringing to them? We are bringing to them a brand new line. Is it the complete line? This is not the complete line, no. Oh, no? Okay, so we, we have half the line right what now. What do we look like? We look like which brand new product that's out there now. You well, know it's, not, it's a new, is it new, new? It's like the new, new, new. Mm. I don't know if it's new, new. I think it was okay. 2018. So let's time now. it. Let's see what, how far into the video we'll start seeing if people start guessing it before we tell them what it is. So what time should they start guessing it? About? Girl, it's gonna be. We'll in give the you title. a couple seconds to get. Oh, <laughs> I'm always thinking these clever ideas, and then I just like, people who I don't, don't like our long intros I don't are think it probably all the way through. mad about. They're probably it now. girl. They probably already left. <laughs> so those that stayed, they love us. Okay, <laughs> those that that did not don't like it, they've been left, girl. Okay, yeah, don't. No, okay. They're not amused. Okay, no. it's Care Care. Mm -hmm. Care Care. Well, actually, it's KC by Care Care Care. The Curl Essence line. Mm -hmm. And we were sent this by CCJ. Thank you, girl. Thank you, girl. For Christmas. And she's Colleen on IG. Yes. Love you so much. So Y'all go follow her. All right. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So we're doing um, Care Care Curl Essence. Mm -hmm. And we did like a little unbraggaging. And when you guys saw it, you thought you were going to review the line. And we were like, yes. Of course, I've been diving into the line because I get yes. excited about new products. You do. You dive sometimes. Sometimes yeah, you don't dive. It depends on the brand. Yeah. You mm -hmm. didn't dive into this one. Mm -hmm. But um, we were sent five of the products. There are ten products in this line. So they rolled out like a full collection here. Yeah. But I feel like if we were shopping for ourselves, we probably would have picked up these five. We would have? Most likely okay. would have picked up. Like looking at the products that we don't have. So we'll go through what we have and then we'll tell you what we don't have. Okay. All right. So let's get started. All right. So let's see. So in this line, there oh, is. There should is I start with this? A co-wash. Yes. Moisturizing co-wash. pick those colors up to a T. Did I know. <laughs> I, I can't wait to see how this is going to look. Because these colors, like, it's kind of gray and it's like a gray pink. I and like, I don't really know what's going on. And then on. you said I have a five o'clock shadow here. You and did? I do. I don't know. It looks like, like a little doggy mullet thing. <laughs> I could see the grayness right there. And I don't know why, like, things can't get any brighter. I don't know why mm -hmm. you have a five o'clock shadow. But looking I don't at know. you, you don't. I look at me, I don't. No, no. I don't. But on the camera, I do. Guys, I we're so see. sorry. We're it's so like sorry. midnight right now. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, okay. There's a moisturizing co wash in this line. What okay. else? Then we have right here the moisturizing curling cream. There's a curling cream. Okay. We have the moisturizing curl activator. Okay. Which is like a like a moisturizing mo like a moisture. Okay. A, a, a layer of moisture. This is another moisturizing thing. We're trying to determine. Yeah, you're like it's like a moisture. Right. <laughs> We're trying to determine before we came on. The three different kind of like creams and their consistency and which yeah. one was heavier. We'll get all into that. Okay. Yeah. And then we also have the moisturizing curling jelly and it's extremely, extremely watery. Liquidy. Yeah. Yes, very. And lastly, we have the moisturizing leave-in conditioner. Okay. So these are what we have. What we do not have is the shampoo and the conditioner in the line. We don't have the oil, the edge control, or the mo the moisturizing um, coconut water spray. Oh. So that's what we do not have. I wonder what that would be like a refresher. You think? Maybe. Okay. Yeah, it's, like, it's a cute little packaging. Little it's like a little spray thing. I yeah. There's an edge control floating out there that I don't have. Yeah. Well, you were interested in this line, girl. <laughs> girl, <laughs> this is kind of like an African pride moment right now. Okay. Like, getting her to try new things. I'm very excited. I have already delved into this line, actually, and I took some sickening selfies on Instagram, where they actually took it and put it on their Instagram. I'll insert that and insert the selfie. Um, okay. Because I'm going to do a different wash and go today, but... Um, the wash and go that I did, you'll be able to see those results as well because I did that wash and go. Okay. So, should we say the wash and goes we're going to do? Okay, why today? not? Yeah. Well, I'll say the one that I did. The first one that I tried when I did my testing day was the leave-in conditioner, and I did the curling jelly, and I will insert that picture um, now so you can see what that looks like. Uh, I like the wash and go. It was a little light, so this time I want to go in with the... The curling cream, because the curling cream is definitely thicker than the leave-in. Okay. So that's what I'm going to do, the, the curling cream and the moisturizing jelly and see what happens with that. Right. You have your pick of the litter because you haven't done anything. I haven't yet. done anything. I definitely want to do so. the jelly. Okay. And I was thinking about doing the curl activator only because I had such luck with that one this summer. Which the can't, the, the can't can too. one that yeah. I loved. But, you, but it, it specifies that if you have thicker texture to use this and what I kind of like put my finger in it it is very thick and I don't know if it's thicker than the cream what do you think um, let's see so the curling cream I haven't even we haven't touched yet it's it won't come out of this jar it is um it's very I'm just trying to get to the top sorry guys <laughs> it's very thick very thick see, even that didn't work and when like you stick your fingers in it like there's like an you guys can't see that there's like an indent okay like so. it's very 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 thick okay all right so wait a minute so this is the activator okay Okay, so that's the activator. Oh, that seems a bit more watery. This is a little bit drier. 
And that's the cream? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, this, I think this is, I think that's So okay. you think it's safe? I wanted to do the activator and then put the jelly on top. That cream to me thinks like it'll overwhelm my head. Okay, so try that. Okay. I haven't tried that, so you'll be able to speak on that. All right. And so that is what's going down in this video. Okay. And we're beginning, clearly. All right, so if you want to see us talk a little bit more about these products and um, put the products in our hair, then please keep watching. Please keep watching. So first things first, water. All right, yes. Water. So, I use the co-wash in the line. Ma, oh my gosh. This is something new you're doing, too. No, you're literally, uh, like, spraying me every I, single time. I think it's because we're sitting on top of each other. That's <laughs> why. That just went all over my forehead. you got to take my <laughs> eyebrows off. Like, come on. <laughs> oh, I use the co-wash in this line. This is my, I use it for the second time today. And I love the way it feels. I can detangle my hair with it. Okay. But I, um... When I rinse it out, my hair gets really stiff and dry. And that's the only thing I don't understand. And yes. it did it both times oh. I did it. Oh, yes, because you have been trying to work that through all after. Like, you're like, wow. So it was the co-wash? Yeah, and, like, even oh. after my, I, we did treatment Tuesday, and my hair felt good. But now it's starting to, like, get dry again. Like, I don't understand. Like, I don't know. Okay. My hair has, like, this dry, like, stiff feeling to it. And I don't know if it's this co-wash, because my hair was fine before the co-wash. And after the co-wash, both times it was kind of busted. But the co-wash, this whole line has Jamaican black castor oil and coconut oil in it, which are both pretty strong oils. And coconut oil can sometimes dry out the hair for certain people. I know some people don't like coconut oil, period. Mm -hmm. um, my hair could be sensitive to it at certain times. My hair starts acting funny okay. with coconut okay. oil, so I don't know. I was trying to like, recapture that experience this summer with just the co-activator, but you suggested because it's winter not to do it. Mm -hmm. Like I just wanted to just put this one thing in like a one and done because I just love that experience. You guys know that I did, um, but I don't know if I should take that chance. So I might have, to, well, I, I want to put the gel on top, I think. I really kind of didn't want, I wanted to see if I could get the same results, but. So what I've been doing lately with creams is um, not really sectioning my hair. So I don't think I'm going to do that again today. So I'm just kind of getting the water to get through my hair, make sure my hair is nice um, and wet. Yeah, no, I hear you there with that one. I wasn't going to because it seems like it's a thick cream, but I kind of want to see if I even want to go in with the gel because I wanted to see if I can get the... See, I like the way it's looking. Okay. It's really making it very shiny and... But it does say fancy. on the product as a styler, it says very soft hold, doesn't it? Yes, it does. Yeah, so it says... Soft hold. I think hold is an e feel of the beholder because <laughs> sometimes people say soft hold and it's it's a firm hold. Sometimes they say firm hold and it's just as soft as it can yeah. be. So I don't know. But just so you guys can see, this is the the leave-in. The leave-in is um is very it's not that thick. I mean it, it has like substance to it, but um like it goops back down, you pick it up, it kinda goops back down. So the leave-in was nice. I felt like last time my wash and go was a little bit like kind of felt kind of soft it was a little bit too soft for me and I don't know if that was because I wasn't heavy-handed with the jelly or if it was because it was this but I do want to try this cream so that's what's about to go down okay mm, it smells good all right so. so I have it I squeeze it out it's right here on the table I just keep kind of like dipping my hand into it just to put it in my hair and I'm just gonna run that through doing my idea of sectioning because as you can see there's no reason to rhyme in our latest videos since the haircut of how I section because I don't know how to section um at this point so I just as long as the product gets in I think I'm, I'm a step above when I first came on the channel when I used to put it in my hand slap it together and slick it back so I, I think I've gotten better who knows maybe that was the way to do it I don't know so these products can run from anywhere I wrote down between $4.99 to about $7.99, depending on where you buy them from. You can get them from the Care Care website. Where else? Um, Sally's House of Beauty. They sell them a few places. So but the whole line was sent to us by CCJ, or did you um, half add the to line. it? Half the line. Okay. Half the line. And then you added to it. So which parts did you add? No, to? I didn't add to it. All these came from, from CCJ. Oh, yeah. okay. This is quite an extensive line then. Yeah. I mean, that, that's a huge line. That's 10 products. Like, does yes. somebody really need all 10 of them products? Unless, I don't know. you know, they Different were things for, but the product junkies will feel like we do need all 10. All 10. So, um, I mean, there's like, we're missing the shampoo and the conditioner. Like, okay. okay. But I always stress that edge control. You don't necessarily, I said that, I like, but I always stress you don't necessarily need the shampoo and conditioner as long as you have your own. Like, today you asked me, did I want to use it? And I said, no. 
I did not. Want I would have been interested now to hear your thoughts on it. I know. I am curious now. I've been having issues, and I really like the way it comes out, and I like the way it feels. But um, all right. So I'm just. I don't always suggest doing this with washing goes. Um, I know when I section my hair, I re it really makes sure the product gets in there. But sometimes I just don't want that like perfect, perfect look. Yes. Especially with creams, because creams can really like constrict my hair, and I like more volume. So. So you don't suggest that they do what? Um, they don't always, like, I encourage sectioning. Oh, right. So this, okay. I don't encourage doing this all the time. Okay. You know, this is how I used to style my hair, but I do I encourage sectioning mm -hmm. to really make sure the product gets in there. Yes. How do you guys do it? Do you section um, your hair? Leave it in the comments. Do you find section sectioning more helpful? Now today I saw, and I think I was doing so much cleaning, I was just getting rid of things I never use. And do you not know that I threw away my rat tooth, is it rat tooth, rat tail? Rat tail. <laughs> What's a rat tooth? Rat tooth comb. <laughs> um, the other day, and then I saw someone today part with it, and I'm like, "That's how you. That's what the long tooth. I mean, tail is for." And it's go you never on. knew people parted with that. That's how like no. people really get down with like the braids no. and, and that they kind sure, of thing. I mean, it was a clean, crisp part. I'm like, yeah. "Wow!" And it was too late, and I. It's probably still in the garbage around right here, but I'm not digging through the garbage. For it because you could probably pick that up. I don't dry my hair in some place. My hair is on the struggle bus today. Mm -hmm. I think it's the weather. Seriously, remember we used to always do that in the summertime. It's the weather. It's the weather mm -hmm. last winter. But I do because my hair um has a little dryness going on here too. Yeah. So we just had a snowstorm, mm -hmm. and there's this tree in our front yard that's completely like leaned over on our electricity wire. And um, the whole tree is ice, like the leaves, if you touch them, like ice, like crackles off. So it's like completely weighed down. Well, me and Spencer are going to go out there today and like get the tree off the line and oh while you were asleep gosh. and it just didn't work out because we couldn't reach. Thank God, because apparently you said we would have been blown up or something I said, like, dramatic. I said, you you said. don't know if those wires are live or not, you know. Like, They're very live because mother, the lights were flickering in the house. mother's rest is never, like you have to always think one step ahead. You would think by now everybody would have a morsel of a brain, um, one in the military and one uh, educated college degrees but obviously they were going to try to lift the tree and take the wire like you know how thick that wire is that extends to the street you know so that you can get cable but, and all that stuff but it's not the wire like it they're covered with those with the black stuff um, right i don't i don't it's know it's like insulated i just it's would never have touched those wires that are so high up um you know every now and then you see somebody with a sneaker they throw it over you see the sneakers dangling, dangling. <laughs> you know so i don't know i just never would have touched a wire like that and thank goodness see god is always watching you know, they said from the time that he saved you when you when you didn't know he saved you, you know. And so, yeah, that was definitely a saving moment because oh, this rest is never done. We were trying to save ourselves from the electricity going out. I oh, know. Everybody's so afraid they're going to get on a cell phone or an iPad, <laughs> okay? Not when they're worried about their own lives. <laughs> But it is, it, it's like a scary feeling. Like, I remember when we used to have those really bad storms and you literally get obsessed with chargers. And, you know, I had a charger going in my car, started the car just to make sure everything. And I would run out every couple of hours to make sure my iPad was being charged. I'd run out, get the iPad, exchange it for the phone. It becomes an obsession when you feel like you're going to lose power. I'm so afraid I'm not going to have enough talking time or iPad time or something. So... You gotta make sure. I don't know, cause at least once a year we lose power. Yeah. At least once a year. At least. Around like September through like February, we lose power at least mm -hmm. once with all the different hurricanes and snowstorms and rainstorms but and. Connecticut called themselves trying to do a little something, something, but um, did they run up a great big bill? My grandmother would say she goes on Beals. Let me go play my Beals. But <laughs> didn't she? Then they wrote a great big Beal. And then, then the next time we came a call to other states, the first time it was so fascinating to see. It was like a caravan. It almost brought pride and tears to my eyes because one storm, storm we literally all suffered caravan. for like nine days. Um, the oh, yeah, trees were that? falling on the wires. Everybody was out of power. There was no water. A fireman would come into the door. You know, I love ice. And they said, is there anything we could do for you? And I'm like, the next time you come back, can you bring me a bucket of ice? And they did. I mean, it was so cool. But then the next year, everyone saw how bad we suffered. So then they all came out from all around. Big yellow trucks coming down the highway. You could see it was on the news and in the town. You know, everyone was like, yay, like, like our heroes are here. And they really started chopping down the trees and really getting us so that it would never happen again. But we didn't pay the bills, that's what I heard now. I don't know if it's true or not. But the <laughs> next storm, girl, who deuces, the other states were like deuces. They, there was no help to be had because like 
all everybody came from all over to help us and i guess it was a deal they girl a deal. where are your sources are they girl. primary sources <laughs> Probably <laughs> secondary sources. Oh, fake news, guys. Right? It sounds like a good story, though, right? Fake no. news. <laughs> but I swear it's what I heard. And whether or not it's true, I don't know. But I bet y'all stay fast. I bet you were listening to every single word I said. <laughs> See, that's how rumors get spread. <laughs> okay. Right? <laughs> Did you use the jelly? Not yet. I'm still styling. Okay. And design. Oh, it's cute. The activator alone is cute. I bet you it could work. I bet you it could work. But, um, should I use the... Just maybe... Weensy beansy gel, right? Weensy beansy. I think so. Just because I just love products and I want to. I'm just really making sure this cream is in my. But from the look of this, I really think this activator. Let me put on my glasses. Girl, it said very soft hold, so it could look sickening right now. I like soft holds though. It could poof up. I really think the job could be complete. I do, girl. But um I'm going to go further. Should I? Should I start the video for that? um that ORS video we did when you were supposed to do two products, we ended up doing a one and done. It came out busted. Yeah, I know. All right, let me just you know I'm just gonna go in very very lightly though. I'm not gonna get carried away. Right, let me see how I'm gonna do this. All right, so that way you guys can at least see the right. consistency. I'm like dead serious working this cream in because my hair is dry. Okay. Okay, I'm ready for some gel too. All right, my hands are slippery now. All right, so. I Sorry. Okay. Ta 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 ta. Exactly. Um, because this stuff is very watery. I know. It comes like pouring out. Indeed. So, oh my gosh, guys, like, like, li okay. like, literally. Oh. <gasps> wow. Like it's this. so slippery. Okay. Okay. All okay. right. Okay. Girl. All, right. <laughs> All that extra. I know. All so right. how I did it was I literally just tap my hand in. Do you? Tap. Okay. All right. Let's see. Girl, that's how I do it, girl. Right, that's, in other words, that's she's stressing very nicely. No, I'm just saying that's how she wants me to do it. I'm just giving you styling tips. That's okay, what I'm here you. for. Okay, thank you, girl. Okay, that was a match. So me. All right, so let me see. You get uh, up this this piece has of slip hair. as well. This just glides in the hair. That's this it. jelly's nice. Okay. This jelly's very nice. Okay. And oh, I believe tap, this tap, tap. this line is curly go friendly, if I am not mistaken. I could be wrong. I have oh, wrong yes. before. I could see it, it made a difference. It kind of clumped them more. And it definitely has slip. And it clumped them a little bit more. Does it say it anywhere? Woo! On the packaging. It's not just to say, like, no silicones, no parabens, no. All of that jazz. Okay. These are the ingredients. Cute. Yeah, I... Oh, it says, there we go. Free of sulfates, parabens, mineral oil, silicones phthalates and uh petroleum so this line is curly girl friendly tap 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 i just got it from the lid this time are you well, at least that jelly is <laughs> <laughs> yeah i like the way it smells if you like coconut you will love it if oh you yeah don't, the smell you it's light it's like light it's coconut. very light but it is definitely distinctively coconut and if you like yeah. the smell of coconut you will love it it's um it's sweet it's sweet it's very coconutty it doesn't smell like say coconut coconut no it smells like like the smell of coconut you know like when things say they're coconut scented this is coconut scented though probably coconut doesn't really smell like this but when you think of the smell of coconut this Straight is what it smells coconut like coconut is nasty like isn't it bitter um, like coconut I, out of the coconut I, thing like yes, water i think it is I'm i don't like coconut yes and I, even though i'm always drinking the bi water and it's coconut water and all that um real coconut yes i don't think it has any flavor or yeah. smell to it like this. I wonder where the scent of coconut came from because real coconuts to me don't smell like that. Yeah, I came in here before and I had my vitamin water next to your buy drink and I yeah. picked up your buy drink by accident because mm -hmm. I wasn't paying attention and like I turned it up thinking it was my vitamin water. I was like, ugh, like, and it was your buy drink. I don't like coconut. Okay. At all, girl. Who yeah, would I know. Who eats coconut? I don't eat coconut on cake, coconut flakes, mm -hmm. coconut anything. I love coconut cream pie. I love no, coconut shavings. You. I love coconut cake when you cut the piece of cake like the Duncan Hines Not cake and then the white coconut. frosting and then it's all embedded with the coconut. No ma'am. None of that. Okay. None of it. No. I will not, what is it, ingest? Coconut. <laughs> I love, love. And the coconut lollipop. Remember we got those gourmet lollipops? Oh yeah. And From um, the coconut. CVS. Mm -hmm. And then 
I always liked, as they call them, the virgin pina coladas because I just like the taste of coconut. I didn't realize when I was younger in my 20s that you could get that. I just always would say go out and hang out like with my friends and I always got pina colada thinking because I wanted that coconut. Um, I didn't realize until one day that you don't have to have rum in it. I didn't know that. I was like, okay. So it's like a milkshake to me. You're a little boring, girl. <laughs> Doesn't it give it that little kick? Um, I don't know what it gives little it. Little kick, um, kick. <laughs> you turn into a smoothie. I did. Okay. <laughs> and then I lay over like by the bar, like when when the bartender's not looking to, to take the olives, because I love olives. <laughs> so I always get the little toothpick. I think they use the olives maybe for the martini or something. I don't know. But they always have olives. They always have maraschino cherries. Like there's always like a little section sectioned off. And when he's not looking, I grab a bunch of olives. We should have a Mad Curls night out. <laughs> right? Yeah. Well, Mad Curls fam wants to come. Mad right? Curls night out. Night out with Mad Curls. Yeah, so where are we going to be hanging out? Right. Where are we going? Okay, so. Let me see. As long as you're not a wet blanket, girl. Oh, girl, I'm gonna be a wet blanket. All right, so now I almost liked it before I ruined it by putting it in this um, girl. gel. We'll see. All right, yet you're still applying. I know because it's so. Either. See products like this. Um, cause I'm kind of going ham too, just because we're talking, and so I'm done. Um, like this gel, like. The more you add, I think it's going to add to the cast. So you, it might feel like you're not doing anything. And right. you just keep adding and adding and adding yes. before you know your hair's going to dry. And you're going to have crunchy cast yeah, on your head. Yeah, no, I get that. So we're done here. Yeah, Yet I are. just dipped my finger. <laughs> yeah, no, I def definitely, no, we're done. I definitely could see that happening. Yeah. So, so we're done touching the product because the product is so light. It's like, oh, is it in? Is it in? We do yes. another layer. And the more we talk, the more we add. Yeah. So we're done. Um, So the product is in. My hair is nice and elongated. Thank God. It's not... um. It's not feeling dry the way it was before. It was dry. Mm -hmm. But okay, girl. Okay, yeah. I like it. So this is the curl activator. And I put the jelly on top. Yep. And I did the curling cream. And I put the and you don't guess this is jelly on time. Normally at this point, I will say to you guys, oh yeah, I can definitely see. I like the way this is turning out. This is going to be a good one. I can't tell. It's um, It's got a strange look. There seems like there's some dryness going on. Some frit. Oh my goodness, some frizz here. Where? Let me see. Like, like here. Um, you see here? Like I know what I like. I know what it looks like. That's looks like it'll be successful. But we'll see. Sometimes I misread it. It may turn out good. What are you doing? Finger coiling? No, your ends are always busted. Okay. Girl. Yeah, they are. Oh goodness. Yeah. Yeah. And these, so. you know, I need some some sort of a cream there that I'm gonna have to work through. Okay. Um, but so I'll take gonna... each section and work through it. I'll explain to you when I come back what, what I happened? did, how much more I had to do, because it seems like it does need a little bit of work here. Okay, girl. Okay. All right. So we are going to go air dry our hair, and we will be back to show you guys these results. Okay. All right. All right. Bye. Bye. And we are back. These are our dried results. Yep. Here they are. And I think I like these more than I liked the. The leave-in and the jelly. I definitely see a difference. My hair definitely feels more moisturized with the cream. I definitely see a difference. Okay. Yeah, I don't but, I don't have a comparison, but I am glad of the ones that I chose. Mm -hmm. Oh, you worked, did the... um. It worked good for me. Then I said I was going to start working. Remember towards the end of the, the beginning part of it, my hair just started looking kind of like weird. I said, let me fix this. Mm -hmm. So what I did when we turned the cameras off was just grab some of the leave-in. And I remember I used the curl activator and then I put the jelly on top. So when we turned the cameras off, I just tapped my hand into the leave-in and just strategically fixed some of the pieces in the front. And the leave-in was very moisturizing. Yes, yeah, so the leave-in might mm -hmm. be the, I don't know if it's the most moisturizing. It's 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 wet. It's wetter feeling it than, than all of these. And I said one thing I feel like this line is missing is like the shine factor here. I mean, yeah. they do have an oil in the line, but I don't feel like I'd want to have an oil dry with this wash and go. I think oil is just something I'd want to add at this point. Okay. But, um... Yeah, it's, I like the way it feels, like the way it looks. It's just not shiny, and I think yes. that's what's missing here. Let me see. It's not shiny. Yeah. But the curls look nice. Um, I, I do think it really highlights the highlight. Really? Yeah, our hair does look a little bit lighter. Yeah. Um, I definitely got an elongated look with what I used. My hair kind of yeah. stayed down where it was. But yeah, it's I like, like it. it's I kind mean, of blowy. Um, I, um, I feel like we used a lot of the jelly. But I don't feel that in my hair. I don't feel it in my hair. I think it's not like a firm hold. I mean, you see I can play in it, but it is a substantial hold. Wonder if it'll hold tomorrow. I guess I'll find out. It says gives great hold and frizz-free definition without flaking. So okay. it never really spoke about the kind of hold it was supposed to give. All right. But um, but yeah, I think um, I think out of these products, I would probably leave the co-wash i don't i don't really care for it okay i like the way it feels at first but it's just the rinsing out part that i don't really like okay. i think the jelly is really good yes 
like the jelly and I like the le I like the curling cream and I like the leave-in. I think there are three cool products to have and you can mix them any way you want to. You know, the leave-in and the jelly, yeah. the curling cream and the jelly, the leave-in and the um the curling cream. I like what I, I did. I like the creams. But I still th I like the like we always call it the reverse like leave-in process where we put the stylers in and then at the end we put the leave-in on top. Mm -hmm. So I like that. That wasn't my intention, but as I started seeing kind of like a little bit of the drying, um I thought the activator might be heavier, but it just seemed like it was frizzing and drying and it was getting weird looking. So like I said, when the cameras went off, I got some of that leave-in and just started pulling it through and it didn't have leave white marks. It was very compatible with, with, with what was already in my head. Mm -hmm. So um, yeah, there was not a problem doing that. And it seemed like it brought back so it, to life and to shine uh, which has since dried, but um, yeah, I'm yeah, glad I did it that way. That wasn't way. a complaint I had when I used the leave-in. So maybe the leave-in is the one is the one that kind of is just the curling product and it adds shine to your hair okay. because the curling cream is very thick and it feels yeah. like a little bit drying. Like not, it feels a little bit drying. Like even in here, like it's it doesn't feel like wet and slippery. Like it's, okay. it's like a dry kind of cream. And then ow, and then um. The curling cream, the curling jelly we were putting in, and we were like, oh, this has slip. Oh, this is like clumping the curls and stuff. And yeah. it felt like it was like wet and shiny, but when it dried, again, there's there's it something did. missing here. It did clump the curls though, that's for sure. But my hair feels very blowy, but yeah. it's holding. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like it. I'm not too disappointed with it. I mean, would I be seeking the stores over and over again looking for it? Mm, no, we did it. I mean, you know, we did what we did to show the products. And, um, yeah, I think if you want to give the, yeah. the line a try, totally give it a try. This is just what we tried in the line. Yeah, there's so many different variations of it. You could make and just, like, play around with it and see what works for you. Mm -hmm. So I'm happy with the ones that I picked. Yeah. I don't feel the need to, like, go back and try stuff because, to me, they're similar enough that I got the gist. Yeah, I don't I don't really like when lines do, like, stuff like this. Like, like if they have, like, a leave-in and then a smoothie and then a curling cream, it's like, they're yeah. all cream, so, like, what's the difference here? I so know. this is just as as the curling cream it's just another white cream in the line so what is the curl activator how is it different from the curling cream and the leave-in when i see stuff like that like i just i always only it's overwhelming yeah i focus on leave-ins and yes. curling cream that's yeah. basically what i focus on or like smoothies i can grasp yeah. a smoothie stuff like activators that's a good starting point and milks i don't know what that is that exactly yeah that's a really good tip though for people that are new to the curly world and you go into a store and you see a line this fast and you see the curl activator you see a curly cream and you see a smoothie and all of that and a milk um look for like the leave-in probably look for the leave-in leave look for the curling cream that's yeah. pretty straightforward because like yeah. what's a smooth if you see like a gel like you know what's the gel then a jelly Jelly, then a right. custard right. like right. It's just, just a lot going on right so. and that's those are the names that they use they name that particular styler in their line if they don't have a gel and they just have like say a jelly, jelly yeah then, then that's the gel that's the gel that's the gel and yeah. then you get a leave it and then go on about your business go okay on. get some but to sit down do like to style your hair do <laughs> one, of all, one of these numbers hey grab some more okay all i'm right. going up to the register all like, of me all yeah, three it's yeah. not necessary um you really it's really not necessary i don't think yeah i mean so. sometimes lines just call either a gel there'll be a gel there'll be a mm -hmm. custard or there'll be a like jelly that's like the gel right. in the line but if the line has a custard and and a gel like yeah come on like it's trying to get your manny right <laughs> manny so yeah. yeah no but um yeah this is what we like so this is what i like i like my hair soft it's, it's a soft and but yet do you feel like there's like a medium kind of a there's hole. a hole do you feel the hole I definitely like feel the hole it. my hair feels blowy yeah it feels definitely feels blowy so yeah i like yeah. again i like the curling cream i like the jelly i like the leave-in Three products I like. Yeah. Those will be on the shelf. I'll leave those there because these are nice. Um, you like the curl activator, the mm -hmm. co-wash. Eh. But, um, yeah. I think that's up. Glad we tried that out. Are you? I am. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> she smiles more so than you saw last week. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Okay. So, um, comment down below. Let us know if you have tried Care Care this line or any type of care card. I know there's like other lines out there that they have that they started with first and they came out with this. This is kind of like their curly line, natural line. Okay. Um let us know. Let us know what you think about our washing goes, what you think. And um I think that is it. That's it. All right. Okay. So thank you so much for watching and we shall see you in our next video. See you in our next video. Okay. Bye. Bye.